guys, this is episode 38 of Minecraft Down Under. What are we going to be doing today? Well, we're actually going to be continuing on the slime block elevator for the main base that we started on last episode. So if you don't know what's going on here, may I suggest going checking out the previous episode so you know how everything works and how we're doing everything. Alright, so last episode I managed to run out of slime blocks when we're on the third one up, but last night I did spend some time in the swamp, and I've got, I had 31, but I've, as you can see I currently use some of them up to get this height. We're almost up to the crafting area, the first stop of our elevator here, so we're almost up to the crafting area, and we've got to figure out a modification on how we're going to, you know, catch the player, and um, also continue on our way if we don't want to stop there so we've got to figure all that out I figured well, this is perfect so um, I haven't tested it yet I think um, yeah I haven't tested it yet um, well, should we do that now we'll jump down on the slime block and do that yeah so I got up to this stage and I thought oh I better stop you know and, and we're gonna jump into ju jump into an episode so I can start uh, playing around with uh, how we're gonna do the next stage here so let's go ahead and give this a test and make sure everything works here um so let's go ahead and no no what we need to do is we got to make sure we have something to land on which we're going to come up a couple just in case safety 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 first and this is where we'll should try land anyway so let's go jump off here hold space bar hold shift Okay, so let's go ahead and go up. So what we'll do while we're down here is put the fence in that's actually meant to be pretty much right there. There we go, like that. Because we're meant to stand there against the fence, press the button, up we go. Woohoo! Yeah, see? It worked perfectly, nice and smooth. Nothing going wrong there. I shouldn't jinx myself, nothing <laughs> going wrong there. So let's continue, let's continue this build. Fantastic. Alright, so, why are we built? you're probably wondering, if you didn't watch the last episode, you're wondering why are we building out of furnaces? Sticky blocks grab everything and pull them with them, so, furnaces, pretty much make sure you it, that does not happen. You can use um, obsidian, I'm not even sure what other blocks you can use, but definitely obsidian and all that stuff, but furnaces, we're going to use furnaces, and we're going to put a cover around this far, this, this elevator, sorry. Um, eventually, so it doesn't look so butt ugly. So I have plans, but uh, we'll see. We'll see. We've got to figure out this section first. So let's go ahead and continue going up. So we need to go up by four, like normal one, two, three, four, and then we need ourselves a sticky piston. Whoop! Oh, hold shift, data, and we're gonna put the block on there. Whoa! Okay, we're up a little higher here. Alright, so, hang on a second, let me get out some scaffolding. We don't need a shovel out, do we? Alright, so what we'll do... Oh, I can't reach! No, it won't let me reach! Alright, that's okay. Alright, we need to come down by one by the look of it, so we'll, br we'll break one. We'll bring down, because that's okay. I know that you're meant to have four, so after... Because, um, when you first start, you're meant to have three up, then a piston, then a slime block. And then after that, you're meant to have four up then a piston, then a slime block, and that goes up. That's due to the timing, or else the elevator won't work correctly. So, um, we can have three, because this is going to catch the player, not really make them continue up. So, it shouldn't break the elevator at all. So, we just now, we do this, and we should be... Can we range? Yes, we are in range. Fantastic. There we go. Alright, so this is our first stop. This is the problem we've got to... We've got to solve this problem now. All right, let's get off of you. Whoa, let's get off of there. So, okay, so what's going to actually happen is when the player comes up, um, he's going to get to this stage that, you know, we can continue it, make, a, make this continue going up, but we want to stop here. So I'm going to in, invert. I'm going to power this. What I'm going to do is go up the back here. Whoa, hold shift. Go at the back. Let's go at the back here. And... Just putting scaffolding in at the moment. There we go. That's how you would normally build one of the, these levels. So that's pretty normal. There we go. Alright, jump. Okay, so yeah, normally you would have your um, block there and you have your repeater there, all that good stuff. We're not going to do that this time. I think what we're going to do is power this piston, that piston there. And that's going to push the block. It's going to push the, 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 the slime block 
end that piston forward, right? And it's going to stay like that, okay? And that's what we're going to do is run power from that pressure plate that powers all that down there up to here and to power that redstone torch to turn this turn the torch off and then you know with tracting the the piston allowing the player to go up and then then the then the power come back on and then catch the player see see that's a good idea isn't it so what we need to do in do first um how are we going to oh so what we'll do is we'll put these put these around here for now there we go so we don't have any problems there so what's going to happen is you know, once this piston's you know extended here, we'll have a button here, right? You pre if you if you don't want this floor, it's like oh I, I didn't want the crafting area. I want to I want to go to the lobby, which is that one there. So you would press a button here, which would power that piston, which will be out here, and pushing you up, continuing on your merry way, and then we just repeat what we've done down there. See, hmm, I don't know if you're following me, if you're following me with the idea here, but. That should work. Don't get me wrong. We're going to have to play with the timings and test it and do all that stuff. It's a little bit high for testing, but we've, we've got it. We've definitely got it. So let's, the first things first is let's get, let's get this inverted. All right. Let's get this inverted. All right. So what we'll do is make, get rid of that torch, make a nice platform to us to work on. And we're going to go ahead and put in a repeater at the back here and just put a torch in. Torch. I don't have a torch. That's okay. Let's go ahead and make some sticks. Four of those bad boys. There we go. All right. Power that. Okay. So as you can see, it's it's inverted now. So okay. So on the way up, this piston's got to go back in. It has to go back in. And see, oh, let's power that piston. See if this, this my idea is going to work. So I need buttons which I put away in this chest from last time. So. Where are your buttons? There you are. Fantastic. I'm kind of excited because I'm hoping to get the elevator done today. And we put the button here, right here. So, uh, it's ugly as right now. I do admit this this build is so bad. We've got to clean it up. It's It's got to be cleaned up. So, we'll put a piece of redstone there. Jump back up in here. So, yeah. Just say you, you've landed on, you, on here. You want to continue up. No problem. Press button. See? Oh, did you did you guys just see see that block being stuck? So what we need to do there is we need to continue with the crazy furnaces here so nothing gets stuck on anything. Lucky it blends pretty much nicely into cobblestone. So I need co need to think of a cobblestone slash um, um, nether brick probably on, around this to go up to, to sort of blend into the rest of the build. So... All right, that is working completely fine, that part of it anyway. So what we need to do now is figure out the timings of how this is going to work. So we're going to run a line if we can get down there without dying because, oh man, this is crazy. All right, so down here, there we go, lovely. So what we'll do is run a line from down here going up. Well, our thing. So now, when a player triggers this pressure plate, it should withtract this piston right away. So it should be pretty much perfect. We've got to do testing, obviously. You know, t test, 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 test. That is the plan. What we'll do? We'll just change this up. That's all good. That is all good. Oh, <laughs> freaking! Oh, crikey! There we go. Fantastic. All right. Let's go down and test that. I'm a little bit worried about testing this, but as I said, once we go over this pressure plate here and it powers the normal circuit like normal, it'll also come up here um, with tracting that. So it should go off at, should go really quick because we only got one torch, not really a delay. We can actually get rid of this and just have power uh, signal there and let's get our repeater back so we don't waste huge amounts of resources here. Um, so there shouldn't be barely any delay there. So let's go ahead and go back down. So we'll just, yeah, holy smokes. Oh. All right. So we stand in the middle like normal. Oh, please work. Please work on something bad's going to happen. I'm the test dummy. Here we go. Crikey. Got to, got to look, got to look. Oh, it worked. No, it didn't work. Oh no. Whoa. Oh, jeez. Crikey. Lucky I only had seven levels. Whew. 
All right, quick, gotta get my stuff back. Gotta, gotta get my stuff back. Go, 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 go. I need my stuff? All right, that death was, that's an okay. Holy smokes, creeper. Jeez, stop putting holes in me, blimmin' map. Crikey, there's enough holes everywhere. Holy smokes, there's one right there. Ugh. All right, test dummy. I'm gonna, looks like I might have a few deaths this episode. Whew. Go, go, go. All right, so nothing's following me. Let's go get my stuff back. All right, okay, that didn't, the, the timing is off, okay? The timing is off, it closed too quickly. It closed when I was half in the block. It needs to, yeah, it closed halfway in the block. It needs to close faster. How are we gonna make it close faster? It's all, oh, we, we just put a, no, we can't do that. Quick, grab all my stuff. I, look, we, we've got pancake data. We went splat. Ah, <sighs> all right, throw this back on. Maybe I shouldn't have armor on. This is going to be damaging everything. All right. All right. So I'm going to risk it. I'm going to risk it and try that again. Screw it. All right. Here we go. For the elevator. All right. What was it? What was it? All right. All right. I got it. I got it. I got it. Okay. So it didn't come back in fast enough. It didn't come back in fast enough. That is not good. How are we going to get rid of a delay? How are we gonna do that? Let me get my stake out. So when I was farming, um, when I was farming slimes for slime blocks in the swamp, I during the day, waiting for night time to, to hit, I was uh, killing all the animals in the area. I managed to get two stacks of steak with my looting sword and heaps of pork and stuff, which was good. Um, if you're wondering where the steak come from, I don't have a steak farm, a cow farm or anything like that. Um, okay, so as we just seen, that delay, it's too big of a delay. How do we decrease the delay? How do we do this? So this is where we got to think what we could do. What we could do? It needs to be a fast. We could do a... It needs to be a fast thing, like a really quick... We could do a monostable circuit. Why would we, No, no, we don't need a monostable circuit. How about we run it off the second one? That might give us enough time. Okay, that's going to be a bit bigger than what we've got here, but we'll see if that works. Okay, okay, I'm gonna, I'm up, I'm open to try stuff. This is what happens when we build stuff, and we need to do, we, we technically need to build. We should have built this in a super flat and tested it all out and seen how it all worked first before going in here and and going crazy because this is gonna, it's gonna be a fiddly job, guys. It's whoa, it's gonna be a real fiddly job. So what we need to do is get rid of that one. So I think we'll just zigzag it up like that. What we'll do is power some redstone so we see how long this signal goes for so we don't waste anything. So we'll power the signal for now just to see how far we can take this signal. Because remember, we don't want to add any delays to this signal right now, okay? This signal is very important that we do not add any delays. It needs to be quick. Go straight up. Actually, we could probably just rig it straight into this lot here. Get rid of that. Oh, it worked. Wow, that's fantastic. All right, so let's go ahead and get rid of the power that we... Oh, did, I, did that work? Okay, that wasn't... that. Okay, I thought I just broke a piece of redstone and I shouldn't have. But that should work out perfectly. Do you want to do some more testing? Looks like we'll have to do some more testing. So let's go down. Uh, what we'll do is put a safety thing right here. Because we landed... We, we've, we sort of glitched into the block here and landed down here before. So let's actually... Let's put a platform in here so I don't die. I'll just take a little bit of fall damage, but not nothing extreme. There we go. Ha-ha! That's right. All right. So let's go down and test it now. So instead of running... Instead of running off, um, instead of running off this section here, we're actually running off the one below. Okay, so now we just need to, that's probably too much of a delay. Whoop, there we go. All right, fantastic. Let's go back in. Let's stay in the middle. Look straight up. We need to, we need to make sure this is working. Whoa, okay, that bounced me up. That bounced me off. Okay, that was a little too quick. All right, let's see what happens. When we add a repeater at the back here, just to add that slightest delay. All right, so let's go back down. Let's go back down here. Testing, testing, testing. This is quite fun. It's a little bit dangerous, but quite fun. I've already died once. 
All right, going up. Whoa, whoa, it worked. I got a little bit of lag there, but it bloomin' worked! Yes, yes, that's right. And then we just press the button to continue and we haven't built this part yet, but I'm just pretending. Let's do, let's do another test. Let's do one more test. Uh, um, I'm just gonna fall back down the hole here because we're gonna have another a down shoot here um, to go down. We're not gonna use the same pipe to go down. So just, just an up. So let's go back down here, hold space. All right. Testing again. Here we go. This does look down. That works so smooth. Did you see that? That timing is just perfect. Yes. Sorry, I'm getting so excited. Holy smokes, that that timing was perfect. I'm, I'm doing that again. I'm riding the elevator again. Screw it. Whoa. <laughs> Whoops, I just triggered half the, half the thing coming down. Ooh, that's dangerous. Maybe I should have a water pool or something down here so I could just jump into it. That would be a little bit better. Okay, one more test, Data. One more test. I think the timing's perfect. All right, let's go up. The timing just looks so perfect. It's so, it is. That is smooth as. Yes, we're on the first level. That's right. Woohoo! Woohoo! <laughs> sorry, I'm just, I'm going crazy. Oh, that. Sorry, that's just awesome. I love when things just come together and work. All right, let's go ahead and continue going up now. So we're going to grab our furnaces here, and um, we got to go up by three, remember? Not four, but three. So remember, the piston's ex extended. Don't put it there. <laughs> that would be a big no-no. We need to put it back by one, like that. And then we need to come up by three. One, two, three. Then piston. And piston, like that. And then sticky. Oh, we might have one more after this. Okay, that's fine. And now we need to build the piston behind it like normal. Get rid of this craft. Why do I have a crafting table? Oh, yeah. Okay. I remember why I have that now. All right. Whoop. Okay, put a piston back here. That's the way it's meant to go. And we need to rig this up real quick, which is just block here, block here. Um, repeater here and what we need to do is put a fence there with pressure plate right here whoop i'm stuck oh there we go all right so that should work and tick did i add two ticks that too many ticks one tick um okay so that should work just fine break all this don't need this anymore and what we need to do is go ahead and bring up we need to bring up the the back plate here because things could happen so we need to bring this we need to bring this back plate up so we just leave a gap like that we'll leave it probably three high so what we'll do is just there we go all right gap gap perfect all right so break all this this is where we're meant to get off get rid of that all right give that a quick test press button oh yes whoa that's going to be fantastic. All right. The continue buttons are working fantastically. Let's go. Yikes. I've got to be careful. I'm right next to the, the pressure plate. As soon as I touch that pressure plate, crikey. You know, far out. Okay. So, block here, block here. All right. So, let's continue this. I'll just continue that up. Um, so, now four. One, two, three, four. Oh, okay. Then piston. Then sticky block. Ooh, okay. We're not going to be able to adjust this because normally we can bring it down by one, but we can't bring it up by one. It's not going to work properly. It's not going to work properly. And if we move the three at the first one down, uh, up by one, then the timing will be off for this one here. So, whoa, did I just break that? Oh, it's instant break. Okay. Um, so, yeah, it is, it's off by one. We can't do that. That's okay. We'll just have to bring the floor down one. That's, that's totally fine. So, we're going to do the same thing like we did down there. Remember what we did down there? So, what we're going to do is see if we can't get some sort of platform so we can work on like normal. Break this. Put this in. We need to invert the signal. And we need to think where we're going to hook this now up to. So, invert this, put... Ah, now this time we're going to put the repeater in. Remember, we needed that repeater last time, so we probably need it again. And then we're going to put 
why we're down heat this far. We're going to go ahead and put that down. And we're going to go ahead and put in the redstone. Like that. And the furnaces. That's not a furnace, Daddy, you fruit loop. Furnaces. We're going to have to make some more. Thank God furnaces are dirt cheap to make. Just cobblestone and button. Which that will continue if you didn't want to con not to continue. Okay. <sighs> Alright, so we need to bring that up as well. So we need those furnaces down here. Get rid of the slime. Yeah. There we go. This will be the second floor we're he hooking up to it. There we go. So we're going to have to just deal with this for now. Which is sad, I know. But, um... Alright, torch. Where's the torch? There we go. So... We're going to have to just have stairs coming down to get off and on this one because we can't bring it up by one, which is sad. Let's hopefully the next one, which is somewhere up there, we've got to break through these blocks for the for the next floors up there. But uh, So let's hopefully the next one fits in perfectly. But that is working fine. Now we just need to work out the timing for this second one. So let's just try to replicate. That's probably the best idea here, is try to replicate what we did for the first one because it should actually work so let's go ahead and just climb down like spider-man there we go so we we end up skipping that one because it wasn't a good idea so we need to hook it holy smokes so we need to hook it up down there how's that even going to work because that's just constant power um geez see now we've got another hurdle to come over this is going to be quite difficult oh man oh well just, just climb down. We need some more cobblestone. We'll go get some more cobblestone right now while we're down here. And I'm just going to have to think what we're going to do next. Where's that crafting table? We'll put our very first crafting table in the crafting area. Ta-da! <laughs> There's meant to be crafting tables all along here. And all along here. And holy smokes, there's a spider on top. Where's my sword? Yeah! Blimmin' Huntsman. Come here. Good. Die. All right. Let's grow, grab some... C grow. Go grab some cobblestone, throw some of this junk away. That will do. And we'll go make another stack of furnaces. Because we're going to need them. Oh, this this is cool. This is the elevator that's going in our base. It's coming along. It looks ugly as, but... It's, it is definitely coming along. Alright, so we'll grab some cobblestone now. Just making sure... Let's see, this is, this is all dug out from the hole. That we're, that from the actual hole going down to block 12. So, let's go ahead and think now. So, remember, we had to skip one because the, it was, the, the timing was too soon and we couldn't actually, we could have used a monostable circuit for a quick pulse, but I'd rather just use something a little bit more reliable. So, as you can see, we had to skip. We skipped that one. And it gave us the perfect timing, that crystal smooth timing. I want that again for the next one. We don't want uh, no dodgy timing or just, you know, or just making it needs to be perfect. So I'm trying to replicate skipping that and then going up to here. So so here, it's got to go from here up to that. But it's going to skip that one. How the bloomin' hell do we trigger um, that one like we did this? Hmm... Thinking, thinking. We could invert that signal there, and then when we... No, because we just press the button, and we go up. Oh, press the button. Hello, data. Okay. All right, I got an idea. I got an idea. We can use this. All right. So let's go ahead and power this button right now. Let's go power this. Let's put a torch in there so we know how much power we need. We got to play with. Fantastic. All right, so when you press the button, you'll get shot up. But plus, plus, it will trigger that one up there to go off as well, putting the perfect delay in. Well, maybe the perfect... I'm not going to... I shouldn't jinx it. I shouldn't jinx it. Let's just keep going up. See how far we can get this signal to go up. Really, I should have... Uh... All right. Come on, this better work. This is this is becoming a jumbled mess. All right, so we need we need act. Oh, we need to go backwards now. Uh, we need to stay away from that redstone right there. Okay, well, what we can do is just come out the side here, then up like that. Trying to stay away from other redstone so it doesn't interfere. There we 
go. And we're going to lose the signal very shortly. That's okay. Oof, zigzagging, this is a bad idea. We lost the signal. Okay, that's fine. It's fine. What we can do is put that in there, and then we put a redstone torch in. I thought I had blooming redstone torches. Fine, I'll just go take this one. We'll take this one. And we power that there. Then run it straight up here like that. Fantastic. So that should be the exactly the same as that. We've got one torch, one repeater. Exactly the same. One torch, one repeater. We now we go turn this power off. Down, 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 down. Break that. So now that should just go up here and just make sure everything's working properly before we do the test subjects again. Yes, that's out. So let's go ahead and fix this area up now and go ahead and put the furnaces in, which did I it did craft. That's 16. Where's the other 64? Crikey. All right. So what we'll do, we can't do that. We need stairs for this section. We need stairs for this section. All right. There we go. Same thing. Ring around. There we go. This is this. I, I, I get we got to fix this up. It's blooming looking horrible. Okay. So what we'll do is just break that for now. Torches. Let's go get some stairs. Let's go get some stairs. How are we going to get down there? I think we'll just go up here. The safest way is to go back down the ladder. Oh, the base is starting to come together. The base is starting to come together. Whew. All right, so what was I up here for? Crikey, I've forgotten what I come down, come come up here for. Oh, stairs, you Fruit Loop stairs. All right, let's. Oh, I need to go back up the top now because the because there's no stone bricks in the chest down here. There's actually stone bricks in the chest up here from when I need them. So we, we, oh, now there's going to be none. All right, there's some there. Let's throw some of these away. Um. We got some stone we can turn into stone bricks if we have to. I thought I had way more than this. Oh, we've got stairs right there, you fruit loop. That's fine. Okay, let's go put some stairs in here. I'm <laughs> right here, far out. That's awesome. Okay, so what we need to do, let's just put some stairs in here. And this is to be the, the way down. So where's our stone brick? So this will be all filled in. We'll probably actually put a wall or something along here, square it off, and so you can't see that because you got to you got to hide all the redstone. This is actually not that much redstone at all. It's just not really compressed. Um, so we'll just turn this corner here, like this. There we go. Lovely, fantastic, and that will be yeah. And we'll have to block this off because that just looks ugly. And we'll come over here and we press the button and it'll take us up further. This is coming this is coming along together. Alright, let's go ahead and go down the elevator. I think it's time to give it a test. Let's hopefully everything turns out okay, because crikey. Alright, down we go. Down we go. Whoa. Ouch. I nearly killed myself there. That would have been embarrassing. Alright, alright, alright. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Okay, stick myself in the elevator, press button, going up, oh, I'm at the crafting area, I don't want to be at this area, I want to be at the lobby, oh, no way, that is just so smooth, did you guys just see that, that is just so smooth and perfect, and I don't want to be at this level and we can continue. And it's quick as. We just come from the bottom all the way up. Actually, let's time that. Let's time that. Let's time to get from the mine shaft block 12 up to the crafting area. Let's time that. Oh, that's so cool. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm excited. That is awesome. Cool. Oh, I want to slime farm more and more now. I want to play with these slime blocks more and more. <laughs> this is awesome. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Start counting. So we're gonna go from mine shaft to to uh, crafting area. That's what we're gonna do. So ready, set, go. One, two, three, four, five. Five seconds. Five seconds to the crafting area. That 
that is just so smooth and awesome. Oh, I'm so happy with that. That is just awesome. All right, I, I think I think we're gonna we're gonna call this episode. Thanks for watching episode 38 of Minecraft Down Under, guys. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like, and I'll catch us all later.